Welcome to Automation Community. Today in this video, we are going to discuss an example in which we will be controlling a solenoid pilot lamp and alarm with a single push button. So let's look at the example first. 7. When switch is turned on and then turned off, then solenoid and pilot lamp will be on. And then when switch is turned on and then turned off, then solenoid and pilot lamp will be off and alarm will be on. That means when a push button is first time pressed and released, then solenoid and pilot lamp will turn on and when the same push button is pressed and released second time, then solenoid and pilot lamp will turn off and alarm will turn on. So for this example, we will use normally open contacts as well as normally closed contacts. We will be also using memory bits and also implement latching. So let's move to TI portal where we will draw a ladder diagram for this example. In case of TI portal version 16, I will go here and then I will go to PLC tags and then default tag table. So here we need to add our inputs and outputs. We have only one input that is push button and then we have some outputs like solenoid so it is an output so its address will be q 0, 0.0 and then we have pilot lamp pilot lamp and then we have alarm so we have added our inputs and outputs We'll go to program blocks and then main ob1. So here we will be drawing ladder diagram. I will zoom into it. So firstly I will insert a normally open contact for push button. I will write P and select push button. And then I will insert a coil and that coil will be used as a memory bit so it will be M0.0 and then I will latch it here. So I will open the branch at a normally open contact and then close the branch. So this is M0.0. So when M0.0 is true, then solenoid and also pilot lamp will turn on. So when M0.0, M0.0 gets true, then this solenoid and pilot lamp gets on. And then When push button is released and M0.0 gets through, then one more memory bit gets through. So this is push button and then this is M0.0 when it gets through, then another memory bit that is M0.1 gets through. And we will latch it here. I'll open the branch, add a normally open contact and close. So this is M0.1. And then when M0.1 gets through and push button is again pressed, then alarm gets on. So when M0.1, M0.1 is true and push button is once again pressed, then one more memory bit gets through. That is M0.0 and that will be last here. I will open the branch at a normally open contact and then close. So this will be M0.2. So this M0.0 will be used here as normally open contact and I will insert a coil 
for alarm. So this M0.2, M0.2 and it is alarm. So we can latch it here. So I will insert, I will open the branch and then normally open contact and then close the branch. So this will be Q0.2. And this M0.2 as normally close contact will be used here to turn off the solenoid and pilot lamp. So this will be M0.2. So when push button is pressed and release, M0.1 gets through and when it gets through, solenoid and pilot lamp gets on. And then this M0.1 stores the data that push button is released and M0.1 stores the data that push button was pressed. So M0.1 gets through and when M0.1 gets through and push button is once again pressed, M0.2 gets through and M0.2 gets through then alarm gets on. And with that, this M0.2 turns off solenoid and pilot map. So I will start simulation. After that, I will start CPU, okay, and then start monitoring. After that, I will switch to project view. Here, we need to create a new project. Let's create the new project and wait. After that, I will go to simulation tables and simulation table 1 and then I will right click here and load project tags. So as you can see here, when I turn on push button, when I press it and then release. So as you can see here, this M0.0 gets through and when M0.0 gets through, solenoid and pilot lab gets on. And then when I second time press and release it, this M0.1 gets through and when M0.1 gets through, this push button was pressed, this M0.2 gets through and when M0.2 gets through, this alarm gets on. And when M0.2 was on here, this M0.2 was on, so here, this M0.2 was true, this uh, will here. This will break the circuit and which will turn off solenoid and pilot lamp. It was all about this example. Thank you for watching.